Hello everybody, this is David with another Verilog video. Uh, this time I'm going to show you how to create a simple ROM and then simulate it um, using Vivado. So here is the ROM module now. It has one input, which is a 4-bit address, and one output, which is 8-bit data. And then for the logic, excuse me, it's just... You know, we use the star always at the star to represent any change in any input, and it would be address. And in the case of the address, whatever the value of the address coming in, um, we have set the data in these uh, for the register. So it's just going to be double of in hex whatever the address is, just for simplicity. Um, Here's the, the simulation. We have a register, a 4-bit register of address to drive the ROM address, the 8-bit wire that we can check the data out on. We instantiate the module under test or device under test, DUT, which is the ROM. Since the names are the same, we can just very simply use the name convention here. Um, I create an integer i that I use in a for loop down here in this initial block. So we're just going to start with i at 0. And as long as it's less than 16, so it'll go from 0 to 15, which will cover all of our addresses. Um, we'll set the value of address to the value of i. And then we will pause for two ticks. And then after this for loop is done, we'll finish. I already ran the simulation. Here it is. Um, on the top here, we have our 4-bit address in hex, 0 through uh, F along the top here. And then, as you can see, the data out for each address is double what that is. And that's because that's the data that's in our ROM. I'll take you back to the code so you can check it out. There you have it, a simple ROM and Verilog. Thanks for watching.